What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Gerald from Bank of Gerald here with another video update. Today is Thursday, May the 12th, 2022. And today we are actually going to, in this video, do an official closing of a platform. It's unfortunate, but it's what happens in the space sometimes. And we're not sad about this per se, because this platform that we're talking about today really was a platform that went the distance as far as platforms are concerned in this space a lot of platforms don't make it to see the first few weeks let alone the first few months and we've been talking about mito finance for almost a year ladies and gentlemen so but without being with that being said i want to remind all of you that i'm not a financial advisor this is not financial advice and i am not your financial advisor i'm just a dude on youtube showing you guys how i'm cranking out that crypto in many different platforms nothing more and nothing less if you like this content go ahead and hit that subscribe button and if you want to be notified about everything going on at BOJ, make sure you hit the notification bell as well. We have heard it through the grapevine. I'm not going to release who my source was, but um, it is a fairly known um, hype uh, uh, reporter, I'll say, or monitor in the space. And they have mentioned and put out there in the space that they, uh, uh, um, well, let, me, let me back up. They have announced that Mito Finance is no longer paying. <clears throat> That's right. Unfortunately, that platform that um, we actually were seeing have some growth. It was having uh, um, Zoom calls all the time. Not that we were on them, per se, here at BOJ, but they were having them fairly often, and it seemed like a platform that had legs and was really kind of growing. Um, but at the end of the day, that's still the kind of space that we're in. It's very high risk. These platforms can be here today and gone tomorrow. And just like we mentioned in the beginning of the video, there's a lot of platforms that struggle to reach the few weeks mark, let alone the month mark, let alone the six month mark. And we were in this platform long enough to actually complete a whole 90 day cycle. And that was 90 days that were business days, <laughs> like Monday through Friday. So it was a long road of getting my investment back, my initial investment. It seemed like it was going to be a long road. And I remember we talked about this. We were shocked and surprised to actually have gotten that and have gotten many withdrawals from Mido Finance. Um, we were kind of hoping that it would last long enough to see some of the bonus money churn out from uh, personal uh, first team growth and going through the ranks and different stuff like that. But it just didn't pan out for us here in this platform here at BOJ. Um, so in this time... Everyone has a choice to make, and I don't think I mentioned this in, in the last closing down of a platform video that I did, but I want to mention this now, and I try to mention this every time a platform goes away. Everyone has a choice. Those of you that were in Mito Finance, you might be a little bit hurt about what's going on in Mito Finance. You might have heard that they stopped paying, and you're really like, whoa, I, I really pumped some money in here. I was really believing. I really. The first rule in this space is you never want to invest at any time what you are not willing to lose completely. And if you were a person that decided to bet the barn and put everything you had into Mito Finance, that's another rule that you broke in this space. This is a place that you bring play, play money. This is a place that's like the online casino for the most part. There are some platforms here that we really do trust. And I know a lot of you are going to be asking me, hey, what are your favorite platforms, BOJ? Because we was just looking at Mito and, you know, now we don't know what to do. Well, in the description of all my videos, I leave the links that are uh, to, to platforms that you can check out and do your own due diligence on that are still paying me to this day. Uh, with that being said, of course, I had to take Mido Finance down. So any future video will not have any Mido Finance links. I'm not going to go back over all the different videos that I've done and take down every single link. That's why I encourage people to stay updated, stay uh, subscribe to the channel, keep the notifications on, um, pay attention to dates on the videos. I try to keep the dates as updated as possible. So when you're seeing a date, pay attention to what date it is for you. Um, I've considered doing the playlist thing, but that's a little bit too much work that I don't really feel like doing. So if everyone just stays updated, you know, at least looks at the caption of the video <laughs> and maybe some comments and watch for a few minutes, you'll stay updated. Just a little side note there. But for Mito Finance, just to get back to the topic, it was a platform that has been paying and is no longer paying. So we are now taking it off the docket 
And we're officially now looking for some other platforms. I've got another platform that I think I'm going to launch today. I'm going to get some information on it. It is not a hype. I'll tell you that right now. Uh, my stance on hypes have changed a little bit, and I'm not too interested in stuff like that. I'm more interested in things that um, carry out or have sustainable plans that can last a few months, you know, maybe potentially a few years. Um, so um, those, those are the things that I'm looking for right now. I'm looking into those things, and I'll bring some new platforms that I believe that we can crank that crypto in um, as soon as I feel that they are available. But everything on my channel as it stands right now, if you look under this video, you'll be able to see all the different platforms that um, I'm currently involved with, have money in. And please remember that I never talk about any platform that I do not have any of my own crypto invested in. I just don't do that. Um, it's not my thing. Um, and I feel like the best way to present information is presenting it from a stance of experience. All right. So I want to have an experience. If I have any experience in these platforms, I'm going to bring it to you. All right. With that being said, uh, put your 2FA on all the platforms that will allow you and all your wallets because crypto is indeed the wild, wild west. And if you ain't strapped, you're bound to get hacked. Ask me how I know. It's not very fun at all. If you like this content, go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And if you want to be updated and notified about everything going on here at BLJ, make sure you hit the notification bell as well. I will see y'all on the next daily video. Mido, it was a great run. Um, it's unfortunate that you have uh, left us, but it is what it is. It's what we're prepared for in this space because we never invest anything that we are not willing to lose. And uh, thank you for the journey. Peace out. I'll see y'all in the next one.